again. <sighs> like Dusty with a ruh at the beginning. Hey, Wayne! What? How do you spell Dusty? I'm scavenging here, Joe! Go ask the dictionary or something. Uh. <laughs> hey, Wayne, I'm going off early. Lock up for me. Here's the keys. Die for them. That's nasty, but I like it. Interesting plant, Mari. There's so much to say in so little time. The school magazine deadline is this morning. Miss Izzy has a boyfriend! Last night, I saw her on a date. <gasps> I'm gonna call her Miss Kissy! <laughs> no, really. Don't encourage him. <laughs> Never seen Miss Hissy that angry before. What's she gonna do to you, Wayne? She's gonna give me a special torture detention. She's gonna make me suffer. I don't care. <gasps> Want me to get old Big Butt off your back? Nah, this'll just give me a chance to find out more juicy stuff about Miss Kissy. By tomorrow, you'll all know who her boyfriend really is. Ha <laughs> 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 ha! face! What did you get a detention for? Being a girl pants? Sit down and stop smiling, Wayne! Lucian is not on detention. He's here voluntarily to help collate the school magazine. Of course. I was hoping that this might in some way intensify your suffering and thus add to my personal pleasure. Start writing lines. Who my teacher kisses is none of my business. One thousand times. Number. I'll get you the big stapler from the office, Lucian. And I'll staple you to Miss Kissy's butt so you can live there forever. Wayne, what are you doing? Research, bean breath. No, Wayne, don't. The public has a right to know. Wayne Cramp. Oh. You've just doubled your detention, Mr. Junior Detective. Come with me. And you can bring my handbag, too, since you seem so interested in it. Oh. I mean, Miss Hizzy? I just have a few errands to run. You can be my little helper. You need your handbag back then. No, Wayne. You will carry it. I'm here to collect my ointment, please. Take a look in the bag, Wayne. I need to be sure this laundry is mine. Yeah. 
lipstick now, Wayne. Uh, oh. ah! Something moved! Wayne Cramp, nothing moved. Pick it all up and hand me my lipstick. Too sweet, too sweet. Uh. Come along, Wayne. Hold my hand. <gasps> We're crossing the busy road, Wayne. Contains work by old people. Don't be so ageist. Adult learners need to be published too. Is it true, Wayne? What? Were you really cuddling Miss Hissy in the back of a pickup truck? No! No! I didn't do anything! By tomorrow, I'll prove who Miss Hissy's secret boyfriend really is! And it's not me either! <laughs> What's wrong with you? Nothing. Oh. And what's the matter with you? Nothing. Sugar, did you go to Dirty Joe's after school today? Who's Dirty Joe? <clears throat> Who's Miss Kissy's boyfriend, Wayne? Go away. Wayne! <laughs> I didn't realize you were a friend of Dirty Joe's. Why didn't you join us in the trailer to celebrate? Miss Kissy and Dirty Joe, sand in the tree. K I S S I N G. First comes love, then comes marriage, then comes we need a baby carriage. Well, children, you will no doubt be delighted to learn that the school magazine is ready. Thanks to a little help from Lucian Cramp. Now, huh. before home time, I'd like to make a few of you suffer in front of the class. Wayne? <gasps> what? I didn't write anything. <laughs> <laughs> Read. Junk is sweet and also sour. I scavenge heaps for hours and hours. Rusty metal bent and dented for all this. My life was meant in. <laughs> they cut my essay for that? Very funny. Just because Dirty Joe is your boyfriend. <gasps> Wayne Cramp, he is not my boyfriend. He's just a mature student who's learning first grade English. That's all. But he is? Yes. Of course, you little worm. Woohoo! Class dismissed. Get out! Get out! <laughs> Wait, Wayne! I just wanted to ask you something. Uh, do you think maybe Dirty Joe really does like me? Ew! Trouble, but she still won't let me have a pet. Ah, <laughs> oh, there's a 
a dead nude under here. <gasps> Don't be ridiculous, Tony. Mom hates dead animals even more. Nude, nude, nude man comb, dance with the blue. Gumball, gumball, gumball. Tony, what in the name of nature are you doing? I have to do this, or the newt man will come in the night and steal all my shoes. You should do it, too. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tony. <laughs> but, but that's just so unscientific. <laughs> no, it isn't. My grandfather taught me this stuff, and it's true. But why shoes? Newts don't wear shoes. Who is this newt man, anyway? I thought you were different. But you're just like everyone else, brainwashed by soap society. You're nothing but a sutty duddy, um, um, a soap sucker. <gasps> a soap sucker? How can you say that? I have always had a great sympathy for the plight of the swamp people. Take it back. Won't. Tony, say you're sorry. You say it. But I'm not. Me neither. <laughs> to you too. Soap sucker. <laughs> Tony is horrible. Isn't he, Wormy? Lucian? Shh! Don't make any noise. <clears throat> yes? Come in. Your father and I are beginning to get a little worried, Lucian. <laughs> Lou. You haven't come out of your room in nine days. Don't you want to go to the swamp or something? Or campaign against a supermarket product. No, there must be something we can do to cheer you up. Can I... get a hamster? No. I might want you to be happy, but that's going too far. Hey, how about Tony? Uh, he's almost pet size. Why don't you go play with him? <laughs> Tony's not my friend anymore. I'm sorry I called you a soap sucker, Lucian. Oh, that's okay, Tony. I'm sorry I didn't believe in the newt man. Please, share more of your great swamp knowledge with me. I'm sorry I called you a soap sucker. Uh, Wayne? It's for you, girl pants! Oh, what do you want? Well, I was gonna say I was sorry. But I forgot. You have to say it first. No way! If you won't say sorry, then you're not my friend anymore. Hey, Tony! You can be my friend. No, he can't. I can if I want to, soap sucker. Yeah, soap sucker! Come on, I'll show you my jump. piece of junk for squashing things down. And this is a fender that I, uh, put rivets in. And this is my human catapult. Want to see how it works? Um, uh, isn't that one of Lucian's scientifically stuffed toys? Yeah, I made him let me borrow it. Steal one of Wayne's friends, then, son. Because Wayne doesn't have any friends apart from Dirty Joe. Go, <laughs> oh, you stupid mongrel! Go! <laughs> you wish you'd been nicer to me when you're old. <laughs> Hi, Wayne. 
Jane. Want to come play with my ponies? No! Tony and I have an appointment down at Dirty Joe's. Don't we, Tony? Tony? Oh, Wayne, how could you? He's a swamp person. Soap folk don't hang out with swamp people. I do. He's my friend. Don't be disgusting. My best friend! Well, I... <gasps> Could you squeeze a bit looser now, please? Oh, sorry, Tony. Your aces, Tony! You keep Wendy away! Door, son. Uh, hi, Wendy. Wayne's not here. I came to see you. Me? Wasn't little Tony your swamp boyfriend? He was, but we had an argument. And now he's, like, all of a sudden turned into Wayne's friend? I guess so. Then you can be my friend. Ah! Oh, it's so nice to see Lucian stealing one of Wayne's friends after all. Behold, Tony! A piece of broken heaven! So much to see! So much to find! Wow, look at this! No, Tony, don't! Whew. Never pluck from the bottom! Junk is unpredictable. You don't know what'll happen. Yeah, the swamp's like that, too. But look, I found a hamster cage. Lucian would love this. And another thing, my brother's name must not be mentioned here! I'm bored, now you said that. Tony is going to be so jealous when he sees that you've got a new friend, too. Especially a new friend like me. Someone out of his league. Uh, are we going to find Tony? Of course. Don't you want to make him feel bad? <laughs> Junk do that. Junk is like swamp, Lucian. Only more meddling. Oh. Oh, Tony. Oh, Lucian. I'm sorry. No, I'm no sorry. really, I am sorry. But I'm oh, sorry. Shut up! Sorry. 